Well, Jennifer, we're here in your new apartment. You came here from Haven from Hope. So tell us a little bit about how long you were at Haven and what brought you there to I was at Haven for like two weeks. Um, what brought me to Haven is that uh, I had a situation um, where I used to live at. So I wind up going to one of my son's friend's house. We stayed with her mm, maybe three days at the most. And then her lights went out. I mean, it was just like we was in the dark. I chose to go to a shelter. My son didn't want me to go to a shelter. He was like, no, Ma, I don't want you to go to a shelter, blah, blah. I was like, well, we, have any, we don't have no choice. Haven is a good place for people to go mm -hmm. if, they, if they want the help, but you can't get the help if you don't want to help yourself. Right. You know? That is accountability. Yeah. My services that I was accessing was to get a place, to so get up housing, assistance. housing assistance, to get up on my feet, to make sure that my grandkids had a better living because that was not the living I wanted my grandkids to have. See, I went there for one purpose and one purpose only, to get what I needed to get done, to get the help, get an apartment, mm -hmm. let them help me pay it, then I take over, mm -hmm. and that's, that was it. And like I said, Miss Carrie, she came into my life, she was really a blessing, because she really helped me. Miss Carrie and Miss Montessor, they were, they are actually good, good people. They're awesome people. They were awesome and they were good to me. I commend Miss Carrie and Miss Montessor because they were actually on it. Mm -hmm. They made sure that I got what I needed and what I came there for. They're really good people to, if you really want the help, then in order for you to get the help that you want, you have to focus on what you really came there for. I mean, especially if you have kids. What are your what are your hopes and dreams now? Oh, to keep this apartment, furnish it, get it looking like a real home, um, take care of my grandkids, pay my rent and do what I need to do to take care of my grandkids. Send them to school, make sure they get an education. As long as I'm living, that's what's gonna happen.